Hello, I'm Detective Angel Rodriguez, and welcome to this week's edition of the Miami-Dade Police Department's Week in Review. On Thursday, 45 officers from Basic Law Enforcement Class 137 took the oath to serve and protect the citizens of Miami-Dade County. The new recruits successfully completed their intense physical, academical, and practical training. What 137 means to me is unity and family. And what we realized was that if we can help out ourselves, we can help the community as well. And that's what we're here to do. We all have a common goal to help the community and catch bad guys. My dad is actually retiring. He served for 34 years, and he's gonna be one pinning me, so I wanna carry on the legacy with him. He was an amazing officer, and that's how I wanna be. Join us in congratulating BLE 137. Welcome to the law enforcement family. BLE 137! Wednesday, we recognized our fallen police canines during the Police Canine Appreciation Memorial Ceremony. The ceremony took place at the Law Enforcement Officers Memorial located at Tropical Park and was hosted by Director Ramirez, President of the Police Officer Assistance Trust. It's just an honorable day and it shows how humans and, and our canines bond together for one mission, keeping our community safe, making Miami-Dade County a special place, and bonding with family, both out here on the field and at home. Yesterday, we joined the family, friends, and colleagues of Sergeant Jermaine Brown for a street naming in his honor at Southwest 117th Avenue and US-1. Jermaine was responding to a crime concern in an all-terrain vehicle along the Black Creek Trail and became involved in a crash on December 12, 2018. Love is to protect those you care for, and on Valentine's Day, our community education specialists and our officers handed out roses at different schools in our county to parents and students who were wearing their seatbelts in an effort to encourage occupant protection. Thank you for watching. See you next week.